Erica Kavam. Bubbly, funny, Instagram perfect life, right? Not always. Behind the perfectly curated squares and witty captions, Erica is human. She has her own struggles and moments of doubt. She hurts, she cries. Just like anyone else, she faces challenges that aren't always visible to the public eye. And sometimes, life throws curveballs. These moments can be tough, even for someone who seems to have it all together. Recently, Erica experienced a very public breakup, reminding us that everyone has a story beneath the surface. The headlines may capture the event, but they don't capture the emotional turmoil that follows. Erica is known for her infectious positivity. Her laughter and joy are contagious, and she has a way of brightening up the lives of those around her. She openly shares her life online. Through her vlogs and social media posts, she connects with her audience on a personal level, making them feel like they are part of her journey. Her podcast, for example, is a treasure trove of personal anecdotes. She discusses everything from her daily routines to her deepest thoughts and feelings, offering a glimpse into her world. But even with her openness, no one expected what she was about to reveal. In a recent episode, Erica opened up about her struggles with mental health, shedding light on a topic that is often kept in the shadows. She spoke candidly about her experiences with anxiety and depression, and how she has been working to overcome these challenges. Her honesty was both brave and inspiring, resonating with many of her listeners. The response was overwhelming. Fans flooded her with messages of support and gratitude, thanking her for her vulnerability and for making them feel less alone in their own struggles. Erica's journey is a reminder that behind every smile there is a story. And sometimes, sharing that story can be the most powerful thing we can do. Erica and her long-term boyfriend were relationship goals. They traveled the world, shared adorable selfies, seemed inseparable. Then, silence. No more couple photos, no more gushing captions. Fans were confused. Finally, on her podcast, Erica shared the news. The relationship was over. The announcement was heartbreaking, raw, honest. Even more surprising, the breakup happened months ago. Erica kept it private. A stark contrast to the instant sharing culture we live in. Imagine smiling for the camera, projecting an image of happiness and confidence, while your heart is breaking, feeling the weight of the world on your shoulders, posting upbeat stories, sharing moments of joy and success, while battling sadness and inner turmoil. This was Erica's reality for months, a constant struggle between her public image and private pain. She struggled to reconcile her public persona with her private pain, feeling torn between two worlds. The pressure of social media is immense, a relentless force that demands perfection and positivity. Being authentic becomes even harder when you're hurting. Erica felt this deeply, the conflict gnawing at her. She questioned, do I share my pain? Do I let my followers see the real me, the one who is struggling? Or do I keep it together for my followers? Do I maintain the facade of a perfect life? A dilemma many influencers face, the constant balancing act between authenticity and the expectations of their audience. Erica knew that sharing her struggles could help others, but it also made her vulnerable to judgment and criticism. Yet, she also realized that authenticity could foster deeper connections with her followers, creating a community of support and understanding. In the end, Erica chose to be honest about her journey, sharing both her highs and lows. Her vulnerability resonated with many, showing that it's okay to not be okay, and that strength can be found in sharing our true selves. Navigating public image and private pain is a challenge, but it's a journey worth taking for the sake of genuine connection and self-acceptance. Erica's podcast became her sanctuary. She poured her heart out, described the agonizing breakup, the tears, the sleepless nights. She admitted feeling lost and alone. One quote resonated with listeners. I felt like I was living a double life, smiling for the world while inside I was falling apart. This vulnerability resonated. Erica wasn't just an influencer anymore. She was a human being, bravely sharing her pain. Section 5. Amicable Split, Maintaining Respect and Friendship Despite the heartache, Erica emphasized one thing, respect. Respect for herself, respect for her ex, and respect for the relationship they once shared. It wasn't easy, but it was necessary. She and her ex ended things amicably. They both understood that their journey together had come to an end. 
But that didn't mean they had to part ways with animosity. No drama, no mudslinging. They communicated openly and honestly, addressing their issues without resorting to blame or anger. This level of maturity is rare but crucial in maintaining respect. They chose to cherish the good times and move forward with maturity. This decision is commendable. Breakups are tough. They reminisced about the happy moments, acknowledging that those memories were a significant part of their lives. Adding public scrutiny makes it even harder. For Erica, being in the public eye meant that every move was watched and judged, yet she handled it with grace, never letting the pressure affect her dignity. Erica and her ex set an example. They showed that it's possible to part ways without hatred. Their approach was a testament to their character and the respect they had for each other. They showed that sometimes, love transforms. It doesn't always have to end in bitterness. Love can evolve into a different form, one that still holds respect and care. It doesn't always end in bitterness. Erica and her ex demonstrated that with the right mindset, a breakup can be a new beginning rather than a tragic end. They walked away with their heads held high, knowing they had done their best. Section 6. Finding Strength leaning on her support system. During this difficult time, Erica found solace in her inner circle. Family, close friends, people who loved her unconditionally. Their support was her lifeline. Erica often mentions her gratitude for her support system. My friends and family were my rocks. They held me up when I couldn't stand on my own. These words underline the importance of genuine connection, especially during tough times. Section 7. The Importance of Vulnerability, Inspiring Others Through Honesty Erica's decision to open up wasn't easy, but it was powerful. By showing vulnerability, she gave others permission to do the same. Thousands connected with her story, many messaged her, sharing their own experiences, feeling less alone. Erica inadvertently created a safe space for vulnerability, proving that sometimes being honest about your struggles can be the greatest act of strength. Section 8. Focusing on the future, new beginnings, and exciting projects. Breakups hurt, but time heals. Erica is proof of that. She's channeling her energy into exciting new projects. Her podcast is thriving. She's focusing on personal growth and self-love. This shift in focus is inspiring. It shows that we have a choice. Wallow in sadness or rise above it. Erica chose the latter. She's not letting heartbreak define her. Section 9. Erica's message, embracing hope and resilience. Throughout this journey, Erica has embodied resilience. She acknowledged her pain, allowed herself to grieve, but never lost sight of hope. She's a testament to the human spirit's ability to overcome challenges. Her message is clear. It's okay to not be okay. Embrace the ups and downs. Keep going. There's always light at the end of the tunnel, words we can all live by. Section 10. Beyond the Breakup, a testament to Erica's character. This experience revealed more than just a breakup. It showcased Erica's character, her strength, her empathy, her ability to turn pain into something positive. Erica didn't just weather the storm. She emerged stronger, more relatable, even more inspiring, proving that true influence comes from authenticity and vulnerability. Section 11. Looking forward, a bright future awaits. Erica Kavam is a force. She's funny. She's real. She's human. This experience, though difficult, has undoubtedly shaped her. We can only imagine the amazing things she'll achieve in the future. One thing is certain. Erica will face it all with her signature humor, honesty, and unwavering spirit. And her followers? They'll be cheering her on every step of the way.